Hi folks. Well, I cleaned my desk as best I could after that embossing session. Let me tell you, it was like I had construction workers in here because there was embossing powder where I was nowhere near. But anyway, so what I want to do is I just want to finish the the closure for this for this uh, journal. So I was going to use this pink this pink organza. Um, I suppose I could use it because I think these this ribbon I wasn't going to use it because like this here it's really bright but when I have it this way okay again okay, once again I've changed my mind this gold this gold looks nice I think I'll do the gold because we have got gold embossing I have this gold trim that I took off the 70s outfits that I got from the charity shop this white is also quite nice because it picks up the white let's go like this audition all three this is how you do it hmm I'm gonna go with the pink if you wanted another color I'm sorry we're going with the pink right now the brads I've got this we are memory keepers and some of them are flowers stars that's just round 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 and the pink is actually a heart so we're gonna do we need two two of those we put this away keep this with us and our pin and our still full of glue Right, so we have our marvellous machine. Thank you, Jessie. Okay, so... Bottom holds ruler, one. Let's go one, four and a half, four and a half, four and a half, four and a half. So we are over there. Okay, so I'm going to put a mark. I've just got a brown pencil here. We're going to do it there. Okay, right, got it on the biggest hole, and we go, oops, oh, I think I'm going to go a bit more in, yeah, go there, like that, oops, and then we need to just trim off the bit of fuzz that's here, And then we just close it and we take our pen, take one we can see and we go like that. So we won't really know we to punch on this side. And that went through nicely. Whoops. Bit of thread came off there, but we will we will just apply a wee bit of glue, and that'll stop that from fraying. Uh, where is our glue? Let me do it now before I put the before I put the thing down. I'm just going to take the glue there, and I'm going to take it there. Bring my thread over. And let's do this side as well, so this doesn't unravel. There we go. That one doesn't have. Okay. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Got it. Put that up there. Right. Now we need to put it right to the end. I know this my machine always sticks when I'm trying to move it over there. Obviously is a technique and I'm not doing it properly. No, I need to come over some more. Come over some more. Come on. Thank you. Right, does this actually say on the thing what size is or I think these are definitely definitely fit here so we need to have this on one 
now that's on three so I'll pull this out these two these two there's one and this side would be a C A there we go so now we take our heart I'm gonna stick it in oh, wait, let's take you out stick it in there and first time I'm using these so and it is a we are memory keepers so it should be grand with this well I've got it in the hole yeah stand up push down what does that feel like it's not going there we go here's a wee little heart oh that's nice I like that that's really good and at the back get you in there make sure you're straight because um, because this is a bit poofy it's hard to see there we go there we go all done Oh, that's quite nice. I quite like that. A little heart. Okay, we'll keep you here because we're going to need you now. now. Uh, I'm going to go like, how am I going to do this? Are we going, are we going like that? Okay. And I'm going, I'm going to go a bit extra so that this will be and this is quite um, it's very fine so it's easy to thread says me and struggles for half an hour <laughs> so just gonna go like that and like that and there's our closure and then this side probably cut too much for the first one but anyway Rather safe than sorry, that's what I say. Where's our pin? Put this away. That's one thing with um, doing videos back to back is you've got to keep tidying up. And it puts a strain on my creativity. I just want to tell you. Oopsie, glue everywhere. Right, so that's done. Just take it and push it through. And this organza I got organza ribbon on on uh, Amazon I think it was about four or five pink purple silver pink purple silver white I think there was five Five different colors and I've got this right so that's gonna go like that to go with our mouse okay so now we are going to do the signatures right so let me just go I think I don't think I'm going to use this because I don't want holes in the although if I made this holes I could put um, put eyelets in hmm thinking 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 hmm should I do that that would be different and then just sew them maybe i should because because um what's the matter shumba who's gone outside I'm not letting you go go slide in the sun it 
door is open so you can go outside okay I think I'm gonna put eyelets in here and then so this in I just want to see where the where the envelope is there I'm wondering if I shouldn't do another envelope I've got 17 pages in here already okay so we are going to I think we're going to put eyelets in the spine because it's going to add as another decoration I have got no pink I want to do uh, this one let me show you this one I did just with uh, wool but I kind of see how it's fraying and I'm, bit, and I'm, I'm a bit nervous especially if I'm going to be selling this journal to to have it fraying cotton so I would want to do mercerated cotton but I don't have any pink and I don't have time to buy pink so what I think I'm going to do is I am just going to actually you know what that's really slippery though I'm just looking at my um, bead making threads and I've got this pink very very fine very very fine this is like 0 0.3 of a millimeter it's too fine okay folks Oh, but you know what I do have? Da -da -da -da. Da -da -da -da. I have this. I think I'm going to use this. Yes, sorry. Let's solve that problem. Okay, so let's do the... Do the hikes, do the holes. And we are just going to go... I'm just going to go like, where's our Tim Holtz? I'm going to go like this, four and a half, four and a half, like that. So, this is the center. This is... So we do this on the three and we do this one on the three. So okay. Like that. And then this one we're gonna go in the middle like that. Judgy judgy, judgy judgy that and that's there for the hole there for the hole and there for the hole okay right. so now we have to move this thing back oh there we go there we go that worked out well so I'm gonna go like that down see oh you're not up that's why you're sticking next one down up you're not up there turn around and the last one okay and let's just do the signatures make sure they all let's see where's our I think I'll just move that up a bit so we can get the bottom one all the rest all nice and what I'm gonna just do where's our center here's our center there's our ballerina here's, I'm just gonna make sure they are all just there, just making sure they're all aligned along that way as I flatten it out. Get my big, my big clip. And my other one. 
Okay, so I'm just checking. Whoops, see how they went skew like that? Let's start again. Okay, get them all lined up in the middle. In the middle. Get that one down there to the ground. In the middle, look where's our oh, envelope is there. Okay. Um, just make sure we capture that envelope, hopefully. Um, yeah, it's actually moved up a bit. Let me just double check. Okay, I think it's actually better if it's down a bit like that. Okay, so now we turn it over. For a minute there, I couldn't see the old purple dots. And we go looking for my looking for the hole that's a bit difficult I'm trying to see where i'm coming down and seeing the dot i think that's it and oh stand up oh and down oh that was a bit fierce next one I'm just going to look on YouTube for ways to operate this thing because surely there must be a way to see see where you where you're chomping because it's a bit difficult. Well, there we go. Doing my my workout here. Okay, now we just have to do the the hearts. One, two, three. You know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to just need to take this bit out here. Yeah. So I think I'm just going to come with the glue and uh, just kind of, you know, give it a little bit of a stay here. This is where you're living. to no 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 don't do this to me now once again I have forgotten to put these fill these bottles up and I'm trying to get my videos done because the barbecue's coming out the braai and when the braai comes out the 80s music comes out and I don't want to get copyrighted so I need to get these done right first one let's do it down this way Okay, make sure it's all the way through, there we go, just give it a, I'm just, uh, I'm just pushing it in there like that, make sure the glue's, mm, there's a heart, get it in there, okay, need to get the little pipirki down, and Push. Don't know why it makes that noise. Beautiful. I like it. Right, number two. Get it in. Okay, and then I'm going to just make sure everything is 
is where it should be. Mind this out the way. There we go. Get down and find the. Noops, 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 noops. And down. Whoopsie, why has this one gone all skew? It's not too bad. And then the last one. Okay, I think I need to make sure that I have this in the exact spot it needs to be. I'm gonna get that under the the flower. There we go. I think that's in there nicely. And push. There we go. Okay, I like that. And of course, it, it's it's quite stiff here. But once your signatures are in, it'll keep everything together. Well, I'm glad to say I finally found stainless steel pins to put in my glue. So I shall keep them safe in a place where I'll forget where I've put them. I know it's a thing. It's a real thing. Okay, so now we need to get our, our needle out and thread our thread. Um, I'm going to do a, one that's got a thin head because it has to go through the... I think my mom brought this from South Africa for me. Right, one, one, two, three, and I'm going to do a little bit extra just in case, uh, well, I, I am going to put charms on, so, just going to go back in there, and I like it when it's not wound on the reel, you can't see the stripey too much. In you go. Okay, right side up. Right side up. We go in there and in there. And we go to the top. Just, <laughs> I cannot believe it. Dudes, I've gone and put these hearts on upside down. Oh well, by the time the thread's on, you won't see. <laughs> so I won't be able to sell this journal. New no, Suri. Mm, down here, what am I doing? Let me just pull this up a bit. These can come off. That's me. Something always has to be upside down, doesn't it? I won't tell you that the pocket, the paper on the pocket, uh, on the on the sandwich bag is uh, is upside down as well. Ah, uh, why did I take those clips off? Because I thought I was being clever, didn't I? Okay, somebody's going to be getting this journal as a birthday present because I definitely can't sell it now. Woman, why did you take the clip off? Sorry, I just want to get this straight and I'm just going to go like that because I'm just torturing myself here. That's nice and long. Get this needle up here. Right, 
I think this is going to be the last video for the day because this day has just been torturous for me torturous everything I've touched has gone wrong but anyway maybe I should persevere persevere there we go right before I even tie a knot this is the right way around upside down hearts well you know only God's perfect so I can't say right here make sure they're in the middle and do it nice and firm make sure it's firm this side yes and go that way and that way and one more just in case there we go because this feels like this string has a bit of give in it right so we're going to leave that out there so we can put bling blings on that's in so now we can start with all our pockets okay so go that way then you go that way what's this what is this bit of fluff that's there we go and that way and like that okay so you can go back in I've put the letter from the journal journal maker I just printed so this lace on the back and just what's this named we might put some more ephemera in this pocket but for now it can just stay in like that right so got our embossed there got our lace knitting lace swan swan lane swan lake need to glue that closed that pocket Bit of printing on the place need to make something for this pocket here but a printing on there we need to put a pocket on here uh, these are thing put a pocket on here lace oh, I printed over the top of this embossing that didn't work too well so you can still see there's bling there and a bit of the lacy pattern so I think we might put a pocket over there just to disguise that side put something in here I don't want to put anything in there we might put a pocket up this side and some trim a pocket over here and yeah this one I forgot to put the ribbon on when I think so I'm just using this hidden paper clip for a closure for this so it's a flutter by a flutter by with net curtaining recycled net curtaining and of course this is not a very uh, how can I say it's a small paper clip so getting it over four pieces of card can be a challenge there we go here's our nice embossed flowers our washi tape so that's done that one's done look at this string of glue am i going to be able to get it off yes see if the glue's dried while it was just laid on top of the paper you should be able to get these stringy bits off there we go oops don't make a hole in your paper and there we go fixed looks like I'm just there 
a handyman this morning just fixing mistakes all the time all right and then this is just the other side that we need to thing we need to i'm going to put a pocket on here we've got a pocket here so we need to make ephemera we need to i think i'm going to put a pocket on here to hide that little bit there that's not so kosher pocket on here we might leave that like that and then we need to fill this pocket here so what we need to do is fill up our glue dishes now and then I've got a couple of pockets made I need to decide if I'm going to do any other pockets and then we can put some dingle dangles on here and then this journal will be done okay folks cheerio now <laughs>